e raised to power 2s is equal to e raised to power x plus 6. Hi everyone, welcome to my class. In this class, we want to find the value of s from this given nice exponential equation. e raised to power 2s is equal to e raised to power x plus 6. But before we proceed, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you. Solution. We have the given equation e raised to power 2x is equal to e raised to power s plus 6. Then from here, remember if you have e raised to power nm is same thing as a raised to power m raised to power n, which is called what? a raised to power n raised to power m. Then we have e raised to power s square is equal to e raised to power s plus 6. Then let e raised to power s is equal to y. We have y square is equal to y plus 6. Then we have y square minus y minus 6 is equal to 0. This is a quadratic equation, and this can be solved by using header factorization method or quadratic general formula. But in this case, we're going to consider factorization method. Then we have y square minus 3y plus 2y minus 6 is equal to 0. Then we have y into y minus 3 plus 2 into y minus 3 is equal to 0. Then we have y plus 2 multiplied by y minus 3 is equal to 0. Then we have y plus 2 is equal to 0 or y minus 3 is equal to 0. Now from here, y is equal to minus 2. This is the first value of y. Or from here, y is equal to 3. This is the second value of y. But recall that e raised to power s is equal to y. Then, e raised to power s is equal to minus 2, or e raised to power s is equal to 3. From e raised to power s is equal to 3, let's take the log of both sides. We have natural log of e raised to power s is equal to natural log of 3. Then, we have x natural log of e is equal to natural log of 3. And remember that if you have natural log of e, this is equal to 1. Then we have s multiplied by 1 is equal to natural log of 3. Then s is equal to natural log of 3. That is the value of x. Also from here, e raised to power s is equal to minus 2. Now, remember that e raised to power s is, is a real number, then this exponential cannot take the negative value. So, we reject this and conclude that no real solution. The only real solution we have is S is equal to natural log of 3. That is our final answer. If you have enjoyed the class, please don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you.